If you are a fan of CR Droid Custom ROM or basically you love CR Droid Custom ROM, then you should try out Project Matrix. We have a new update available for this custom ROM and why I am talking about Project Matrix because one of the reasons is Project Matrix is one of the upgraded version of CR Droid. It brings you all the CR Droid features, but including that new UI, new interface, new options to customize and a lot more extra things. So yes, it's based on CR Droid. So I don't think so you will feel any major difference in the terms of performance. Moving on to some of the customizations directly in the home screen in the launcher first of all. It's similar to CR Droid, it is not bringing you any kind of pixel launcher pre-installed. It is a normal pixel, basically it's normal launcher which is called as quick step launcher. It brings you same similar kind of features but few add-ons, few additions are also the UI with this default launcher is a bit ex bit changed you can say. Upgraded one as compared to CR Droid, this is the one which you have right now and if you take a look at the recent panel you will notice a difference as compared to the CR Droid. So yes, if you want side by side comparison with CR Droid, I can make video on that one too but yes, it is already looking so good. In the settings app, you will notice the settings UI is quite changed in CR Droid. We have very, very simple, minimal stock kind of UI in settings. But in this case, it's now card style UI. And also, it has the option available for you to enable these widgets on the settings interface. It's up to you if you want to enable this thing or not. Moving on to the user interface here, you have the option for settings homepage widgets. So definitely it's available as an option. If you want to enable this thing, you can. If you don't, if you don't want to enable this thing, you can simply ignore this one. We already have some of the options related to customization. For example, fonts. The font engine is also present in CR Droid. But yes, as I just mentioned, it's an updated version of CR Droid. So we have different kind of font font engine available. Other than else, everything is just literally same. And as you can see, user interface options and all these options are also a bit changed. We have some new interface almost everywhere as compared to CR Droid. Also, it is looking like bit of looking like one UI style, which is definitely okay. And if we take a look at the status bar options, we have a lot more upgrade options. For example, you have the option for VoLTE and Vo Wi-Fi icons if you are using them. I mean, many of you actually use this thing. Personally, I don't, so I will not be able to show you, but it's here. So definitely just wanted to let you know. Other than else, as you are expecting any feature, you are hoping any feature, most of the features are present here. This one is one of the best one, which is called status bar padding. You can adjust the top, right and left style icons. You can change, you can move the icons from right or from the center or anywhere else. Looks good one. The quick settings panel also has an option for background opacity, which looks good. So you can adjust the transparency level in the quick settings background, which is completely fine. And as like CR, it also brings you Android 11 style quick settings panel, although this is not available as an option. If you want to make it look like Android 11, you have to choose a circle. You have to choose a circle tiles, then you have to adjust the rows and columns, which is not a big deal, but definitely it's here. So you can adjust it according to your own preference and everything else is just literally same like the data usage option and clear all notification button. It's literally same like CR Droid. Moving on to the miscellaneous options, you will find high developer status, which is completely okay. The ignore window secure flags, let me tell you one thing, this option does not work with Telegram. So I just tested it, so that's why. Another thing is the spoofing options. The good thing is it brings you this custom PIF, which is play integrity fix file. So definitely this is an advantage as compared to CR Droid. And other than else, we have hide screen capture status and no storage restrict. These are some great features. If you install this custom room, you will get to know more about this one. The lock screen also has the upgraded version as compared to CR Droid because it brings you the preview of these custom clock styles. And as far as I know, these custom clock styles are not present in CR Droid at all. Other than else, we have the depth wallpaper feature. We have the option for accessing something, some gestures, some weather settings, which are completely okay. So this was all. These were the things just wanted to let you know about Project Matrix. This is the latest version, which is having the October security patch. So yes, it's updated similar to CR Droid. So don't miss it out. Link is already there in the description for all the official supported devices. Thanks for watching.